kids, welcome to Rex Pine TV. I'm yours, Don Lorenzo. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You will now be seated. Today is Tuesday, March 9th, 2021. Let's go to Randy to see what happened today in history. Thank you, Yazdani. Today in history on March 9th, 1964, the first Ford Mustang was road tested and ready to be offered to the public. The beautiful car was also introduced to the public after a month of being out at the New York World's Fair at Flushing Meadows Park in Queens, where the Ford Company reported over 22,000 orders from car dealerships around the U.S. nation. No doubt this was a lighting star for the consumers. Now let's go to Scott for the sports highlights. Thank you, Randy. Today's sports highlights are brought to you by the Patriots. The javelin throw is a track and field event where a sphere about 8 feet 2 inches in length is thrown. The javelin thrower gains momentum by running within a predetermined area. 27-year-old Johannes Vetter is a German athlete who competes in the javelin throw. He ranks second in the world in his personal best of 97.76 meters in February 2020 is the German record. In an interview afterwards about the 97-meter throw, he said, It was really close to perfection. In an open field with a good backwind, I think that throw would have been 100 meters, but I'm really happy. Now let's go to Own Alicia for the lunch report. Thank you, Scott. Today's lunch is turkey tacos, wild white nacho Doritos, fiesta beans, corn, mixed fruit, salsa, and milk. Bon appetit. Now let's go back to Yosdani. Thank you, Own Alicia. Scholars. March Madness is officially on and runs until this Friday, March 12th. We are down to our Elite Eight in our Epic Already Showdown. Keep up the amazing work and cheer on Ms. Belantre, Ms. Arazo, Ms. Anaya, Ms. Cavalito, Ms. Samuel, Ms. Luis Massard, Ms. Campbell, and Ms. Balanjano. Patriots, keep track of your class status by viewing the tournament leaderboard on the wall outside of the cafeteria. Single elimination rounds will determine the champion class. The incentive will be pizza and ice cream for the winning class. Also, middle school scholars, complete all of your class assignments and you get invited to a pizza and shaved ice party. It's as easy as making sure you turn in all of your work. The pizza and shaved ice party will be this Wednesday. I'm looking forward to seeing you there. Now, let's see what the weather's going to be like today with David. Thank you, Yos Donnie. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 75 degrees Fahrenheit and probably cloudy. Looks like a nice day to play a game of Frisbee with your friends. Now let's go to Simon for the joke of the day. Thank you, David. And here's today's joke of the day. What do you call shoes that are made out of bananas? Slippers. Now let's go to Simon for today's birthday. Thanks, Daniel. That was awesome. Today's boys and boys and girls are Stefan Salima and Brielle Carbon. Happy birthday! Let's go back to your Donnie. Thank you, Sonia. Patriots, don't forget to pass expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kind towards others, keep the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Ms. Hendrickson, Ms. Dry, and Ms. Newton. You all had the correct answer to Friday's video, which was. I have two arms, but fingers none. I have two feet, but cannot run. While I carry well, I have found I carry best with my feet off the ground. What am I? The correct answer to the riddle was a wheelbarrow. Also, congrats to Ms. M. Denkwa, Ms. Julian, Ms. Newman, and Ms. Hendrickson. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was, They can be harbored, but few hold water. You can nurse them, but only by holding them against someone else. You can carry them, but not with your arms. You can bury them, but not under earth. What am I? The correct answer to the riddle was a grudge. Not for today's riddle. I could be cracked, I could be made, I could be told, I could be played. What am I? I could be cracked, I could be made, I could be told, I could be played. What am I? Teachers, please send your answers to times.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for a response to be reviewed. 
One of them will be announced the following day. Everyone on RBTV would like to wish you all a terrific Tuesday. And don't forget, remember, unite, rise. Have a great day.